hello guys and welcome back to my youtube channel i feel like it has been so long since i've had like my hair done all nicely in my youtube videos um i got my extensions put back in yesterday and i'm so happy to have them in again even though i absolutely loved having five weeks worth of no extensions and having my hair in a bun every single day i am very excited to have some hair again um i go to lux studios in nunda for anyone that is wondering and i get their flat wefts they are so so good um it is a little bit shorter at the moment because I'm due for some new extensions some fresh ones but I'm just waiting for those to get ordered in but I'm kind of like I'm kind of lacking the shorter length like I feel like it really suits me I don't know what do you guys think I also realized that I haven't had my hair like curled in so long like it would have been like months um, because I've just been like dysoning it I don't know if that's a word dysoning um, but yeah I've just been dysoning it every time I wanted it curled and I'm kind of into the like actual barrel curls i feel like they look really cute i obviously got it done well i got it done yesterday so i haven't like touched up or anything so they've held quite well especially for my hair i feel like it falls out so quickly but yeah that's enough of the hair chat i have a very exciting weekend planned for myself not for you guys obviously but hopefully it's entertaining for you it's friday so happy friday you guys probably aren't watching this on a friday but Happy Friday to me. I have a busy work day today actually, but the rest of the video will be way more fun because it'll be Saturday and Sunday. Um, but I did just get a White Fox package that I really want to show you guys some of the items from. I'm going to, like some of the stuff I've already posted in before, so I'll show you guys those and like link them. Um, but I also got some new stuff as well, so I'll show you guys. What I got, I'm obsessed with White Fox's stuff at the moment. It's all so cute and they have so much variety. So yeah, I'll show you guys what I got. I have so much stuff here to show you guys. <laughs> it's wild. Um, my discount code for White Fox, in case you guys don't know, is AliXO. It's always AliXO. Um, so yeah, that will save you 15% off site wide and I'll link everything down below for you guys. But I'll start off with what I'm currently wearing. So it's this really gorgeous t-shirt it's giving skims vibes i am obsessed with it it is so comfortable so soft yeah it's actually really nice and soft i love the cut of this tee it's really nice so it actually is this length which i love so you can either wear it like out like that you can wear it tucked in so it looks like a bodysuit or you could wear it like sort of like ruched up you could also wear it tied if you're into that um but yeah it's really really nice and soft i'm obsessed with it i feel like it's just like really like effortless pair with yeah like jeans head out happy days i also have these jeans on this is my this is today's outfit it's just like really nice and comfy um i love that it has the little like slits in the back there as well i did also get where is it i got the white in I sorry the t-shirt in the white as well and i'm so excited to wear this i'll probably wear it at some point this weekend so i'll show you guys that on um but yeah it's really really soft i love these so much i also got these cargo pants that i'm well and truly obsessed with so they have the little detailing there you also have the pockets and yeah i love these i'll insert an overlay of me wearing them but i'm obsessed with these i got a top specifically to go with these where is it i got this top here i've been eyeing this off for ages and i just think it's so cute so it's just this little um cupped top it's super cute it's a long sleeve i've been stocking up on all of my cute like long sleeve tops heading into the cooler months and yeah i'm obsessed with it also has this little like adjuster sort of thing on the back as well which i also love and then i also got wow there's so much stuff here i'll stick to the crops because we're we're just already there um so i also got this really beautiful corset top i'm well and truly obsessed with this it has adjustable straps and then the zipped back and i wore this i'll insert a photo of me wearing it with this white skirt and it was just so cute but yeah you could wear this with so many different things i feel like corset tops are a must have all times of year to be honest because they go with so much especially when you pair them with a mini skirt and like a blazer or jeans or really nice like tailored pants or even um like really nice like structured pants as well i feel like that looks really really good so absolutely love her and the cupping on it super cute while we're on the corsets i also got this one it is so nice so it's not see-through or anything um, up through the top, but then it kind of goes like mesh 
through the bottom there. So cute. You guys went crazy for these pants when I posted in them. They are such a vibe. So you like roll this down or insert a photo of me wearing them here. Um, but yeah, they're just like a black cargo pant and the fit of them is so perfect. I love these. I'm just well and truly obsessed. I actually did get the black version of that white top um, so that I could wear it with those pants again. Cause yeah, I just love this top. I think it's super cute. I love wearing like, like I like my arms being covered in winter, but I still like showing some skin sometimes if it's not like well and truly freezing. Um, as long as it's only like a little bit cold, then that's obviously perfect. So obviously love that. And then what else did I get? Oh, okay, yeah, I got some really cute like dresses and stuff. So I got this little black mini. Again, I'll insert a photo. I'm obsessed with the fit of this mini. It is incredible. I'm gonna get so much use out of this. This is just something that I'm gonna have in my wardrobe forever. And it in the black is just so perfect heading into winter. You can wear it just on its own, really hot, really spicy, or you can wear it um, with like a blazer and stuff all done up. Like I was wearing it. I wore this to dinner the other night actually. And it's just like really comfy. Like it's really comfy. I just love it. And I feel like I don't like wearing, like I don't really like wearing baggy, not baggy, but like flowy dresses underneath blazers and stuff. So I feel like this is perfect because it's really nice and tight, but it's still like elegant and structured. So it looks really good underneath a blazer. And then speaking of blazers, I also got this bad boy here. So I actually have a few blazers from White Box and I just love the fit of them. They're so nice. Um, so yeah, this is this one. It's like a little bit more plain and like, yeah, really nice and structured again. I feel like I was never fully a blazer girl, but I'm a blazer girl right now. I'm obsessed with them. I just feel like they're such a vibe. I feel like, I feel like, this sounds so weird, but I feel like I was never old enough to get away with wearing a blazer. Is that weird? Like, do you have this like, I feel like when I was younger, I was just like, no, I'm not old enough to wear that yet. I don't know what it is, but you can wear them whenever you want, guys. That was just like an issue I was clearly having, but I love the length that it finishes that. It's not like super oversized. Um, you could size up if you wanted it oversized, but I like it being a little bit more fitted. I feel like things that are too oversized, um, like this sort of drown me out a little bit. So this is perfect. And the quality is amazing. It's like all lined. It has the shoulder padding and stuff as well. And the thing with blazers is you only need a handful, if that. Of really good ones like if you just have one really good black one you're sorted a couple is ideal but if you just have like a really solid black blazer they're so versatile you'll have them forever and they go with so many different things then i got this gorgeous dress which i again well and truly am obsessed with i'll try it on for you guys but it's just like a halter neck and i just think it's adorable actually just so cute i wish i had something coming up that i could wear this to but i love the gold detailing at the front i love the frills i love the whole thing the fabric's really nice it's like double triple lined or something so it's not see-through or anything um but yeah absolutely obsessed with that that's probably like my favorite item actually no these tops are my favorite item from the haul i would say this would be my next favorite. Then I got this dress. Sorry, I was wearing it the other day. So you guys went crazy for the white version when I wore it when I went to Sydney. So they were fully sold out, but they just restocked them and I had to get it in the black, of course. So cute. I'll insert a photo of me wearing it here. These are just like so pretty. Like I feel like this is just a pretty dress, you know? I love it in the white, but I thought the black was really cute too. I think the white is my favorite though. Um, the black is like really hot, but I think the white is like really cute and girly. Um, but yeah, the fit is amazing. It almost feels like it's not a swim fabric, but it almost feels like that. Like it's really nice and like soft and comfortable and it falls really nicely. It's like kind of heavy, like not super heavy, but like heavy enough that it just falls nicely, you know? And then lastly, I got this adorable little um mini skirt set and i love her so we've got this sort of like the same sort of like shape as this one. Oh, i was holding it around the wrong way um in the little top 
so cute it's actually brown it's looking like kind of dark on camera it's like mesh and all lined and i love it the fit is really nice it's really comfortable again i'll insert a photo of me wearing it here for you guys um but yeah i'm gonna try on a few of those now and then so they can be inserted as an overlay for you um but yeah i'm going to head out and get lunch i am craving oak berry i've been craving it all morning that's what we're doing we've just had a slight outfit change i'm just wearing the white version of the black that i had on before with the jeans jake and i are gonna go to oakberry because i have been craving it all day i've been holding out um i was gonna get it this morning after pilates but i had to shoot some lounge stuff so i was like i mm, don't really want to be super bloated so i'm gonna hold out and wait so now is the time and i'm very excited you guys know that i love oak berry it is a part of me now Romy, Romy, stop it he always steals the exfoliating gloves from the um like from the bathroom if we leave the door open can i please have that wait i got the usual coconut chia pudding vegan granola peanut butter strawberry blueberries and cacao nibs and it is the best thing in existence jake copied me it's such a good combo it really is I know, and, and I like getting the small. The thing, yeah. yeah, it's so good. I like getting the small because then you have like more of the topping, you know? That's like my logic behind it. Hey guys, sorry, I've been a little bit MIA. I was just editing some YouTube videos, getting some work done. Sorry, I'm just making dinner, making a curry for dinner. I'm very excited. I love a good curry. So I'm just doing that. Jake just got home from the gym, and we're gonna have a quiet Friday night in. As per usual, we were going to maybe go out but I need to be up early tomorrow morning to go to a booty class actually so priorities health and we have quite a busy weekend so quiet night in and then eventful weekend that's the plan Jake and I are also going to head into the city on Sunday and I really want this bag I've just reserved it so they said they have a couple in stock but yeah they put one aside for me and I think it's so cute in the white it's just like a really cute casual bag that I'm obsessed with. I feel like it looks really cute with just really simple outfits um, like cargoes and little tanks or tees, anything like that. So yeah, I love it in the white as well. So we're going to go look at that on Sunday and Jake's on the hunt for some things as well. So we'll see how we go. But yeah, how cute is that? I think it's bloody adorable. I've been holding off on this for a while, but I just saw a girl wearing it on TikTok actually and I just fell in love with it again. So that's the plan for Sunday. Look how cute these boys are. Hi besties. Hi besties. <laughs> They're actual little twinnies. They're obsessed with each other. <laughs> well, Romy's obsessed with Milo anyway. My favorite boys, yes, yes. Dinner is just this really beautiful curry with heaps of veggies. So it's beef and then carrot, onion, and beans. And then we just have some rice. This is all HelloFresh as well, guys. You guys know I love HelloFresh. This is not sponsored. I did work with them a few months ago. I have just been buying their meals literally ever since. I'm obsessed with them. They're just so yummy and fresh and delicious. Like. I love that there's so many veggies in this. It just like makes the biggest difference. Whereas like with normal meals, I just feel like they don't like add that in there. But I'll show you guys how many um, of the cards I have. Like, look, look how many I have. <laughs> I have like two novels in here. There's so many. Like, I am sorted. Sorry, no food puppies. And that is dinner, guys. It's so good. I just had a little cheeky taste test and it is delicious. Good morning, guys. I have been so slack with the vlogging, but we have had a very eventful morning. So this morning I was up really early. I went to the booty class at NQ Fit. It was really good. And then we, well, I got home and then we took the boys for a walk um, just to like the local school here so that they could play around on like the grass field and stuff. And then Milo tripped over he tripped over I think like Ravi ran into him and then Milo like tripped over himself and then he started limping and he didn't have like movement in his front right paw 
So it was like 7.30. Um, so we like looked up their vet and it opened at eight on a Saturday, which was amazing. Their vet is so good. Um, so we took him straight there and we were just like holding him the whole time until we took him there. And he just looked so cute. He just looked like so sad and it broke my heart. But yeah, he looked so cute at the same time. And he wasn't like sucking or whining or anything. He just looked really, really like sad. Um, so yeah, we took him to the vet and he was actually all good, thank God. Um, they just ran some, like they just like fell all down his arm and he was fine. Like he didn't like whine or anything. Um, so she thinks he's just done something to like his muscles. So they just gave in him an inflammatory, anti-inflammatory injection, I think. And then they gave us some medication for him to have each day for the next few days. And we're just going to keep an eye on him, but he is like walking on it again. So that is good happy about that he still looks really sad and like upset um i'll show you guys how he looks he literally looks so cute he's just asleep there he's to sleep with his brother it's actually ended up being such a nice day today as well so yes that has been our morning so far we are going to head out to breakfast though we're meeting some friends for breakfast um, we actually got this last weekend and it was so good. We're going to Paddock. Paddock is like hands down the best cafe on the Gold Coast. They just have something for everyone. I used to be obsessed with going to Paddock when like I used to live in Brisbane. We'd drive down here just to go there and it's just the best. Um, so I'm just wearing this outfit today, even though the weather's really nice. It's still like a little bit chilly when you're in the shade. So I'm just wearing this. Um, it's all white fox again. It's like that really cute. Um crop top and then the pants you can wear the pants undone at the front as well like i showed you guys in that photo and they look really cool like you can have the white showing but i feel like because i'm wearing the crop top it's just like too much skin and i'm like gonna be eating and stuff you know so we're wearing them done up um but yeah we're gonna head there now i'm so excited we got the i think we're gonna get the same as last time except for maybe we won't get the acai the acai wasn't that good um, we're going to get the donut French toast and the avo on toast, add feta and halloumi. And I also forgot last time um, to get Jake gluten-free bread, but he was a soldier and, sorry, he was a champ and soldiered on. I don't know how I'd say that. <laughs> was so good oh my god i'm like so full from the donut french toast though my eyes are definitely bigger than my stomach um i also had some of jake's avocado on toast because i can't just do sweet these days i have to do a bit of sweet and a bit of savory um but i just dropped jake and the boys back home because sorry that just went really overexposed um because Milo needs to rest obviously and I need to go well I don't need to well I do need to I need to buy some more chicken <laughs> for one of my meals um, so I'm gonna do that and then I also want to buy some fresh flowers for the week I really want to buy actually you know what why am I doing this hmm I really wanted to buy some roses but I just realized I'm going to Sydney on Monday Oh, okay, let's abort mission there. I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna go to Coles instead and just buy some chicken. I was gonna go to Brickworks. If you guys are on the Gold Coast, you know you like that area. It's really nice. I was gonna go there and get some like fresh fruit and stuff and chicken and some fresh flowers. But I just realized we booked Sydney last night, really last minute. Um, I'm going there next week for an event. Jake is coming with me. So what's the point in getting <laughs> fresh flowers? Am I well? That was the silliest decision of my life. Um, it's because I really wanted to get fresh flowers for the week. Like, I've wanted to do that all week. Like, it was on my, like, to-do list of things to do. Um, but we're obviously going away now. So, I'm glad I had that realization before I drove all the way there. Because it's, like, kind of close. But it's still, like, 20 minutes, like, half an hour away, I guess. So, yeah, I'm just going to go to Coles now and get some chicken breast instead. So, let's do that. 
bit boring. I've secured the goods, I got the chicken, we're all good in that department. I'm about to head home now and I need to do a few work things, but then I'm actually going to lunch with my girlfriend, Natisse. We are going to La Luna restaurant. I love it there. I'm not gonna gatekeep it from you guys. It's like Southport area, like near the Palazzo. Um, Versace, if you guys know like that sort of area near like the marina so stunning I'm obsessed it's been getting busier and busier there though so everyone's like figuring out like what it is and hearing about it which I'm a little bit sad about but also it's really good for them and their business so that is awesome um, but yeah the food there is so good they've got like a really big variety of food in my opinion the food is like it's not like 10 out of 10 but it's like eight or nine out of ten like across the board it's like it's good you know like I haven't had a bad thing there and I've had a lot of stuff there so yeah I would recommend I'm not gonna get keep it from you guys I would definitely recommend going there go there while it's a bit quieter as well like with a group of you do the banquet we had the banquet for my girlfriend Tasha's um, launch event the other week and it was delicious so so good um, so yeah I definitely recommend that but yeah Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys about Sydney. So yeah, Sydney, that was a whole debacle. Um, so yeah, we booked that really last minute because basically I'm going down for a White Fox event. So Jake's coming with me. So we were like, oh, we're not just going to go for one night. We may as well go for two nights. So we're going down Monday night and then the event is Tuesday night. But then I've had this booking with the Carlisle for ages in Brisbane. Um, and I've already changed it twice. And then they were like, this is the last time we can change it for you. So they were, being, they were a little bit annoyed at me. Um, so yeah, I can't change the date of this booking. So we have to drive to Brisbane, catch the return flight from... Brisbane to Sydney and then back on Wednesday and then when we get back Wednesday we need to check into the Carlisle which is fine it works it's just a bit chaotic so that's fine I would rather than be like spread out by like a week um but I seriously can't complain so that's what we're doing next week so I might vlog that I'm really excited to go we're gonna stay in Double Bay which we haven't stayed at for a while now we keep staying in like the city so I'm excited to stay in that area because it's just so nice there um so yeah that's what i'm up to next week but i'm gonna go home now and check on milo and get some work done and then get ready i'm all ready for lunch i'm wearing this really cute dress from white fox i'm obsessed with it i think it's so adorable i'm uh, going to pick up natisse along the way and then we're just gonna go together but yeah i'm very excited i honestly love the food there so much um but yeah how cute is this dress i think it's just so adorable i think i showed you guys it yesterday maybe it was it yesterday yeah i feel like this week has gone so quickly <laughs> lunch was so good the traffic was so bad though it took us an hour to get home from Southport and usually it's like 25 minutes because there's like a festival on in surfers apparently so that was a little bit annoying um but I'm just chilling on the couch right now with the boys we're actually about to go see a movie we're gonna go see the Northman or something like that um but I don't want to leave the boys they're just so cute they're being so cuddly I mean they're always cuddly but I just don't want to leave him because Milo's being a little sucky boy. This is Milo here. After his debacle this morning, um, yeah, we're going to go to the movies. I'm just wearing this um, White Fox set. So comfy. I've been living in it ever since I got it. I love it. But yeah, lunch was freaking amazing. Every single time I've been there, it's just so good. The view was amazing as well. They put us in such a nice spot right next to the water. And it was actually such a nice day today. And I wasn't expecting it to be a nice day. Like I thought it was going to be really rainy today. So that was a nice surprise as well. So yeah, that's the plan. I'm also going to try the uh, Biscoff Kit Kat. Very excited about that. Natiz has had it before. She had it like a few days ago. She said it's 20 out of 10. She thinks it's incredible. So I'm gonna get that as my movie snack. Guys. Oh, oh there is one. I was like, I couldn't see, so I thought there was none left. And then I just flipped it up. Wow, that's amazing. It's meant to be. Happy days. 
How good is that? You're blessed. <laughs> I was so sad because I thought that they were fully sold out. Like Jake was like, they're all gone. But there was fun. Left, it was Up meant to you. be for me. Half price to a dollar. Wow. I'm so yes. not interested. Wow. <laughs> Did me dirty there. Got so excited I wasn't even paying attention. Luckily, I love Chunky Kit Kat, so that's alright. The movie was terrible. We watched The Northerner. Northman. Northman. Probably one of the worst movies I've seen. It had potential, but it just wasn't it. Like, I feel like no. the filming was good. Oh, yeah. No. It was wasn't horrible. It was it's not it. And Jake and I love that shit, so that was not it. So now we're at Grilled. That's where we're at. Good morning, guys. Happy Sunday. I still can't get over how badly I fake tan my hands. I'm not sure if I showed you guys that already or not, but we're just going to ignore that situation. Um, it is, yeah, Sunday today. I'm already, we're about to head into the city because I'm going to check out a new bag that I think is so cute. Um, they've been around for like a little while now and I was holding off on wanting to get one. I feel like you have to like make the decision whether you want something or not first before you start like obsessing over it. So I saw it like a few times and then anyway, anyway, I saw it on this girl on TikTok and then I fell in love with it all over again. She was wearing just like a white tank top green cargoes and just this bag and it just looked so good so and like really effortless and the bag just looked really cool um so yeah i'm gonna go check that out and we also didn't realize there's a balenciaga in brisbane so we're gonna go there do that and then i might even get like a photo or two while we're there and then i've got to come home and get ready and prep and pack for our little getaway because we're going to sydney and staying at the Carlisle directly after and then my girlfriend yeah Natisse is actually looking after the boys as well so I see make sure that the apartment's like all clean and tidy ready for her it is like pretty clean I just need to well we're just washing the sheets so we're doing that and I feel like that's a bit of a mission within itself I hate washing <laughs> the sheets I feel like it takes a whole day to like wash everything because we put on like the hour-long cycle and then drying takes a, just takes ages and then putting everything back on the bed, you know, the drill. I feel like this lighting's like really dark. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna make myself a smoothie for breakfast actually. I did like originally when I wanted to go like to the city on Sunday, earlier in the week I wanted to like go out for breakfast and stuff and or like lunch, but because we're gonna be in Sydney, it just seems silly to just be eating out so much so i'm gonna make myself a smoothie now just my standard banana smoothie you guys know the one and then we're gonna head yeah head off this is my outfit as well by the way guys i'm just wearing um white fox again i love these cargoes they're so comfy i just love like the fit of them they're really nice and then you guys know i love this top i have it in the black as well but i wanted to get in the white I actually bought this one myself <laughs> because i love it so much and um yeah it sold out so when i saw it, it was back in stock i snagged it really quickly my smoothie in my starbucks cup ready to go goodbye babies goodbye bye my twins you guys i love it it is so cute isn't she gorgeous such a cute little shoulder bag we secured the goods. It's literally stunning. I'm not going to open it because you guys saw it in the store anyway. Um, and I'm going to film an unboxing for TikTok. But I'm actually going to sign off this vlog now. I'm sorry. It's been like a little bit random and all over the place this weekend. I actually ended up being way... I know it didn't seem like it was hectic, but it was just like jam-packed. It definitely won't seem like it to you, but I feel like I just had so much to get done. So I'm a little bit flustered. Um, and yeah, I'm going to sign off this vlog now because I have so much packing and stuff to do i need to wash my hair blow dry my hair 
remove my fake tan, reapply my fake tan. I need to get some more content for brands before I go away tomorrow morning, just like stories and stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna start off this video now. I'm also gonna make some lunch, have some lunch, do all the things. And I think I'll vlog Sydney anyway. So I will see you guys then. Enjoy your week whenever you're watching this. I love you guys so much. And also make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel if you aren't already. Um, because we are so close to 100k subscribers and it means a lot to me. Thank you guys. Bye.